Hey everyone, I have a couple scrapbook layouts that I'm going to share today. Uh, I made this layout a few months ago. I realized that I haven't had a chance to share them on YouTube and I'm about to put them away in the album. So let's just get started. The first one is about my daughter. Uh, when she was just a few months old. And this layout is a submission to a design team call for frosted designs which i'm on the team right now so it's been a little while ago and i have to apologize i kind of forget what papers that i use on this um i'm pretty sure the background over here the gray one this is a regular um pattern paper this is not a cardstock and i believe this one it's from uh I might be wrong, but it might be from um, Jelly Bean Soup or Echo Bart. That's my guess. So if you really want to know what paper collection I use, let me know and I can go through my stash and find out for you. Uh, I use a doily over here and then I added a chipboard button sticker from Hampton Art Hampton Art that I got from Tuesday morning the foot long sticker and then um, I did a border punch over here using the daisy border punch and I added randomly added paper tape I believe this is from uh, pink paisley or might be girls papery totally forgot that was my very first paper tape so I was just throw them apart and then randomly put it here and there and then I added a twine from uh, my man's eye and button over there and I always put a glossy accent on the tail over there so I don't I don't like the tail kind of move around too much so I always glue them down I added some pearl accent I think it's from Jenny Bolin and then and this is just a label from uh, my mind's eye and then over here um, the circle the scallop circle over here and this bowl sticker uh, it's from jelly bean soup i believe it's a i kind of forgot what collection it was but i think it's a homemade six and then right in the middle here i added a pearl bread this is just a strip paper from my stash and then the ticket die cut over here it's from say sei and then uh, i titled this one a good time this one just a sticker uh, alphabet from echo park and this is a wood veneer alphabet from pink paisley and then this is just a american craft ticker and then i added a quotation there it says this time like all time is a good time if we but know what to do with it i think it's really cool it's by ralph waldo emerson and then on top over here it's a uh, love this picture and then i decided to add it, a polaroid die cut which i don't have the die it's basically manual hand cutting polaroid die, die cut so um, basically how i did this i uh, kind of measure you know the pictures uh, and this is three by three and i added a little bit on the side on the side it has to be the same on the side on the side and on top and then i added a little bit more on the bottom and then i cut it first that one and then i kind of punched the part over here in the middle and then just cut the border i hope i make sense that's how i did this polaroid die cuts over there so it, i don't use any die or anything so it's just a hand cutting die and then this is just some um uh flower punch you know um those hang on let me show you it might make more sense if i show it to you Okay, if I can find it too, give me one second here. This is the punch I have, the border punch. Well, this is not really border punch, but anyway, this is the punch I have. And it punched all those uh, flower. 
and those are the flowers that I use on that one instead of you know throw them away that's that's the flower that I use and I just add a bling in the middle and then this is a die cut from uh, Julie Bean soup the same one from this one I think it's a homemade six collection it says so very happy so yeah so this is my first layout about my daughter um, pretty well I say it's pretty simple except that Polaroid die cut uh, oops sorry kind of have to hand cutting it yourself so there you go so yeah so that's my first layout and the second one it's a layout about my son again I made this a while ago uh, this is just a random layout uh, I just had a time to make a scrapbook layout so I decided to make one and the paper that I use on this one mainly mainly from authentic again I can't remember what the name of the collection um, let me know if you really really want to know the paper the paper so basically it's just a picture of him and my husband and this is just different sizes um, can I put them on top of each other that kind of thing kind of make it more like a messy look or <laughs> random look that kind of thing and then um, this is I remember this one it's from a uh, bow bunny from at lip I think that one and this one and this is a uh, bow bunny border sticker too uh, I call this hello mister this is uh, Cosmo Cricut. This is uh, American Craft Thicker. Um, this is some bread that I got from Walmart from that dollar collection. And then this is just okay. I believe this is all from Hell uh, from October afternoon. Oh no, this one, that one, that one over there, the camera. But this arrow over here it's Emmy Tangerine remark book sticker book and I believe this one too everything here is wonderful so again pretty simple layout um, actually this one I had a like a you know what do you call that uh, I started and then it took me like two three hours to actually finish it because it was just so hard to put everything together you know find the right color and paper because again I try to break the bad habits of using one collection which I end up still using you know authentic I believe this is authentic too but I forgot or the green one so anyway yeah here's a picture of my son when he was just a few months old because he was born uh, winter 2007 yeah he was just probably five months old or less than that anyway those are my two layouts and again i do apologize if i couldn't remember all the collection the paper collection and if you really want to know let me know i'm trying to keep um updating my youtube you know after i'm done you making a layout I, you, I'll remind myself to do a video. So anyway, thank you so much for watching and I will I will see you again soon. Bye.